everyone. I'm Dr. Colleen Halupa. I'm the Dean of Online Education at East Texas Baptist University. I'm also the Program Director for the Clinical Laboratory Science Program. ETBU's Clinical Lab Program is specifically set up for community college students or military students who have completed technical training school. In order to qualify for this program, you have to have completed clinical laboratory training and your clinical rotations. Our clinical laboratory science program is a bridge program for students who have completed their MLT training to go on and complete a bachelor's degree in clinical laboratory science. Just to give you some background on myself, I started out as an MLT in the Air Force and I finished my degree and then I went on and became, at that time, an MT or medical technologist, which is now a medical laboratory scientist, and I sat for my ASCP registry in um, both at the technician and the technologist level. This program is specifically designed for students from community colleges who have completed their medical laboratory technician training or for military students who have completed technical training in medical laboratory. In either case, you can come to ETBU and you can finish your Bachelor's of Science degree and your general education credits. We take entry in fall, spring, or summer, so you can enter three times a year, which allows you some flexibility. You do not have to take or pass your MLT registry prior to entering the program. The next thing I'm going to talk about briefly is our curriculum. The curriculum for the program consists of 40 junior and senior level hours in advanced clinical laboratory science. There are no additional clinical training courses. The only courses that students have to do any kind of shadowing experience is in the laboratory management experience course. In this course, students have to find their own preceptor and spend 40 hours shadowing either a departmental or a laboratory manager and performing some sort of project for that manager that has practical application. In addition, the program has a two credit hour certification preparation course. This is to ensure that you're prepared for the National Registry. This course has to be taken either the last semester or the next to the last semester before you graduate. ETBU is the only online program at this point in time that's allowing students to take the certification preparatory course more than one time. If for some reason after graduation you would take the National Registry and you don't pass it the first time, then you can come back to ETBU and you can take that refresher certification prep course up to two more times at zero tuition. Our class time is limited to 20 students because we want to ensure that you have a personal experience. Hi, my name is Vince Blankenship and I'm the Director of Adult Education here at ETBU. I'll be the person who will assist you through the admissions and the financial aid process. So first of all, let's talk about the steps for admissions. First of all, you'll need to apply for admission and pay the $25 application fee. The application for this program can be found on the CLS website, which is etbu.edu slash CLS. The next thing you'll need to know is to submit official transcripts from all colleges that you pre previously attended. And for the transcripts to be considered official, they need to come directly from that university to us. For those of you who live close and come for a visit, you can bring in a copy. It just needs to be in a sealed envelope. Make sure you don't open it. All right, when your file is complete, then what we would do next is work with you to find a time to register you for class. That can be done by phone or uh, by email, but we'll work with you on the time to get you registered for class. The next thing you need to know is that you have to maintain a 2.0 GPA overall and a 2.5 GPA in your CLS classes. Now as far as cost in financial aid, the cost for the program is about half the tuition rate for our normal students. So uh, because of that uh, deep discount, there are no other ETBU scholarships that are available. However, federal and state aid is available. And this includes grants and loans. Um, you'll have to follow the FAFSA each year for that. And the FAFSA code for ETBU is 003564. Payment is due at the beginning of each semester, but for our long terms, fall and spring, you can divide those payments into five for the semester. You can divide those charges into five. So just uh, want you to know that our program is very transfer friendly. We uh, will take up to 72 hours transferring in. And 
like I mentioned, I'll be the one helping you through these processes. So if you have questions just as far as before you do anything and just want to know how the program works, feel free to contact me. And then anytime throughout the process, I'll be here to help. We hope to see you soon as a student here at ET.